pandemic it gave me a lot of time to think about what's the next phase of my career you know guys like Cedar Walton and uh, Harold Mayburn are gone and I knew I needed to step up and uh, do some new things and I got a chance to play with uh, the great Kurt Rosenwinkel at the Vanguard and it, it literally blew my mind away I'd never experienced anything like that and it was like a whole new realm for me and so I knew then that uh, I wanted to be where he was trying to take me to be that's where I wanted to go and I could get outside myself, get outside my normal routine, and, uh, and then I knew the guy that could be a perfect compliment to him would be Emmanuel Wilkins. The way those two play are uh, things I haven't heard before. <laughs> Musically, the way he plays my music was just a revelation to me because it has exactly just he you know the same roots you know playing with these cats is, is just incredible yeah so First off, it's an honor and a wild opportunity for me to play with all these guys. I grew up listening to all of them, so it's awesome to just be in the room and get to make music with them. Musicians just doing what we do, playing with each other and bringing our own flavor to the music. And it's very, you know, wide and diverse range of styles in this band, but, um, you know, we all come together for the music and it comes together the way it does. I mean, you know, that's time to swing. That's time to swing there, you know. Uh, you know, Farns is one of my favorite drummers uh, to play with. Super comfortable to play with, always. Just, I have a ball playing with him, so it's good, good to get it on wax. I mean, this is the first time that me and Kurt are playing together, too, um, despite both having a Philly connection, you know. Um, but, I mean, he's also just, I grew up listening to him as well, and he's, he's one of my favorite guitar players, so it's also just such a pleasure to be in this. It's a really good group of people, you know. Great music, you know, it's great for me, you know, to get exposed to new cats and, and, and new music and it was, it was kind of kicking my butt a little bit, but uh, it, was, it was in a good way, you know, you know, I had a great time and, and, and uh, it's a great, great project. Thank you. 
Foster told me a long time ago is uh, be true to yourself. And, you know, I was trying to figure out what myself really is. I mean, I know about Max Roach and Art Blakey, but who am I? And uh, be yourself. It's like, you know, the times of like trying to conform to this or play this way, you know, it seems like nowadays it's uh, try to be free and uh, live free, happy, joyous, and free. That's what I want to try to be. And be yourself is the easiest way to do it. Mm -hmm.